To get from Mexico to Texas, you have to go through a port of entry or cross the Rio Grande. Amid the influx of migrants crossing the southern U.S. border, two pictures went viral, claiming to show members of the U.S. Border Patrol putting alligators shipped by train from Florida into the Rio Grande as a way to deter migrants. Verify viewers Edward and Teresa asked us if those images are real. So let's verify using these sources. Alligators are native to part of the Rio Grande, but the alligators in these pictures aren't even real. The viral images were created with artificial intelligence. Let me show you how we figured it out. First, let's zoom in on this picture of the alligators on a boat. You can see warped details that wouldn't appear in real photos. Here, the Border Patrol agents have no discernible facial features. That's a red flag. And here, several agents have arms that appear fused with the vest they're wearing. Oh, and two of the alligators are missing eyes. And one's face is warped. Now let's analyze the image of the alligator strapped to a train car. One of the uniformed people is missing a foot. At least one alligator appears to have an extra pair of legs. And all of the alligators besides one in the front have warped facial features. And some of them lack eyes entirely. Another red flag? The text on the side of the train car is gibberish. All of these errors are telltale signs that the images were created using AI. So we can verify that the viral images of Border Patrol putting alligators into the Rio Grande are not real. They were generated with AI. Regardless of the fake images, there is no evidence that the U.S. Border Patrol or the Texas National Guard dumped alligators into the Rio Grande. With your Verify, I'm Ariane Till.